What's up, guys? All right. How's it going? Uh, me and Jordan did a survival island, and uh, my fraps wasn't working. Let me check if this is working now. I'm going to be really, really pissed. Yes, it's finally working. I had audio troubles. Jordan has audio troubles. So, uh... Pretty much what happened was is that we started out here with a sand island with one tree, and now we have six trees growing. One of them is not growing because it's a loser, and we have 30 or 51 saplings. We have a giant mine. This is Survival Island, as I said before. It's huge. It's pretty big on some forms. I have a diamond pickaxe. You know, yeah. Don't care. Although we did lose those diamonds, remember? Yeah, table. J Jordan had like a lot of diamonds and he ran into the cactus when he was dying from hunger and uh, lost all of them. I question our friendship. Well, I'll uh, go mining some more. We'll see if we can find some more. Um, I'm just going to give you a little uh, estimate of how long we've been playing. We Three hours. Yeah, we played for three hours, and this house is still not finished. <laughs> Mostly because we can't find clay. Otherwise, all of that, and we need more sand. Sand. Lots and lots of sand. That's all we need. I forgot to grab torches. I'm gonna have to come back up. I'm surprised there isn't a competition thing to make a cake. That's the one I usually see in survival maps. All right, make a cake. Why? I don't know. It's just it's hard to do on a survival island to find all the ingredients because you have to spawn animals to get the milk, which we still haven't seen an animal after three hours of playtime. Yeah. Wait. So, have you found any sand down here at all? Or uh, -uh none at all. Yeah. It's so much more easier to get sand in the mines than it is in. The... Do we not have any torches left? Or are they? They might be in a different chest. I don't think no, I don't think we have any torches at all. Well we do have another two sixty four stacks of coal, so we're put these in the furnace. It's like having a whole hay penny. It is. It's a lot like having a whole pain hay penny. Bonus. Use the lava to make a lava god damn it, Jordan. Yeah, I accidentally covered up that lava. <laughs> Oh, yeah, Jordan pretty much already finished the map and uh, found the lost treasure of the crater. Yeah, yep, it's, it's, it was pretty shit. Only the good that came out of it was the nether rack that we used for the chimney. Otherwise, the TNT, I guess we could blow up later or something. And then sandstone, there's pretty much no use for that. And then glowstone we could use to light up something. Oh, yeah, sandstone. We don't need any of that. Just, you know, not to build our house or anything. There was no, or I, I meant to say glowstone. I don't know. Glowstone will be pretty useful. That, that's what I was saying. It's glowstone and netherrack are the only two useful things. And then TNT if we want to be real miners and blow our way down here. I don't. And then the mine, uh, mining cart track thing jigger. Gosh, this cave is so huge. It is. It's very huge. I'm gonna get lost. I got lost. I wondered, like, the whole last 30 minutes of that recording was me wandering in the same circle trying to find my way out. Why are there... Oh my god! What? It's slime. It's like... Ugh. Yeah, I know. There's some slimy stuff. I'm running into, like, so many slimes, though. I need to go back to where the X was and dig down and see where it led to. That's what I need to do. Build a glass bridge over the lava. Yep, I, I just mined around it. There were some diamonds over there. Uh, is that where you found the diamonds? Well, I found, uh, I think, eight of the diamonds right before that. And then I found the uh, ninth diamond like hovering over the lava pit, and I got it. All that's really down here is just skeletons and zombies. It sounds like it. No, no, I don't see rain. Yeah. That was weird. I heard, I heard the noise, and I thought it was like rain, but it might have just been like a cave sound. Yeah, probably. I'm actually gonna dig straight down over here, and there's coal already. 
So pretty much that any anything that anybody really missed was uh, I was drinking tea. Jordan mined a lot, ran around in caves. I mined. I I, I farmed sand. I just realized I was using my diamond pickaxe, and if it's a trick that I land in lava and lose that diamond pickaxe, I'm gonna be pissed. So I'm gonna go get an iron pickaxe and not lose the diamond pickaxe. I'm gonna try to wait, find a way to navigate myself out here. You do that. I shall. I need three of these. Um, I think we should actually start building our, uh... Oh yeah, we already found lava, so now we could probably start building our, uh, skeleton spawner trap. No, we need the zombie spawner trap, that's what you said. No, skeleton. We have to build a skeleton one, and we have to build a zombie one. Oh, I didn't realize it. Oh, you had the forums up, I remember now. Yeah, oh, I don't have it up right now, I just remember Hey, this is a skeleton one. Alrighty. Yeah, I need to come back with better supplies. And I'm gonna make this like maybe like a more open path. Um I need sticks. I got completely distracted there. There's some hair in my eyes. I'm gonna get that out of there. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna um a slam ball. I'm gonna make this kind of a uh, more of a functional kind of mine down here for the uh, spawner. Okay, I'm putting what the hell? And I don't want to yeah. lose those torches. Ah. No, I might as well keep those torches. I'll keep half those torches. I'll keep half of half those. Torches. Wait, how much? Do we have any cobblestone up top? Cobblestone? Yeah. We have like yeah, well over a hundred. All right, awesome. The doors are really loud. Didn't they change the sound that the door makes at one point? Yeah, sorry, I'm digging straight down. This is where the X marks a spot thing was at the beginning. Oh, that's probably just where the carrier's thing is. If you go down deep enough, you know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, it's the skeleton zombie spawner. Oh, it is. Or the yeah, the skeleton spawner right here. That's what yeah, it looks like. I almost killed it too. I wasn't paying attention, <laughs> and I landed on it, and I just kept mining for a second. And I was like, wait a minute. Uh, now I'm discombobulated again. Oh wait, there. That's where the entrance should be. What if there's anything under it? There's coal under it. Um, never can go without too much coal. Okay. So, um, I'm kind of building more of a, uh, something right here where I can, uh, well, There's well an enderman. it's going to be where you can just, um, I just friends. heard an enderman teleport, just so you know. Really? Yeah. It always creep me out. People are like, Endermen aren't scary? Yeah, well, fuck you. I'm gonna keep mining down under it. Okay. Alrighty. Um. No. Okay, um. Ow! Yeah, I heard that skeleton jack, too. Oh, there's dirt. Whoa. Hey, I need you to come up here, because I'm gonna have to... I can't have you underneath there when I'm building this. I found a lot of gravel. I'm just gonna keep going down until I hit bedrock. Well, I might need to come up soon. So. Well, I'll probably just kill myself then. Do you have anything, anything on you? I have an iron pick and an iron sword, but we can make another one of those and it's about to break anyway. Alright, well I'm covering up the hole. I hit bedrock. Which means I'm coming up. I'm coming up, so you better get the pot started. Isn't this song like made in like the early 2000s? Yeah, I think so. That was terrible. Nobody liked the early 2000s. 
Except N64 fans. Yeah. There were some good games that came out then. And I hit my head on something. Don't mind that up. Okay. Yeah, come here. Okay, I'm just gonna Ow, ow, ow. Oh, hunger. Ah. Let me out. Help me. Yeah, I need, need to give me some to eat. Uh, I don't know where I'm going. You changed everything. I had no idea that that was a two blocker. I remember that being a single block. Oh, I have three hearts and a half. I have three hearts. Two hearts and a half. Don't shut the door on me, you prick. <laughs> two hearts. Heart and a half. One heart. Is there any food? Any food? Any food? Ah, ah. I have a heart. No, no, no! That sucks. That does suck. I, mean, you, I, I heard you steal my experience over there. I did no such thing. Yeah, I, I, I did. And I have my diamond chest plate. Um. I forgot I was wearing that. I might just die because I don't. I don't think we have any food. In this world? I no, there's a, there's just no food. Well, th what do you mean there's no food? Look at all that weed over there. Yeah, there's no food at all. None. Zero. Squat. Now, if only we could get animals to spawn. If we can get animals to spawn, we can do anything in life. That's it. I am googling animals spawn. Rate. I'm gonna say it's very, very, very low. And farm is. I got food, so I'm not gonna die. Approximately 1 in 10 newly generated chunks will contain mobs, usually in a pack of up to 4 of the same species, and will always spawn on the highest available block in a column. The one that can see the sky. Uh, for an animal to spawn on it, this block must be opaque, and the two blocks above it must be non-opaque. What? Well, Jordan, you have the difference between opaque and non-opaque. Very rarely new animals can spawn in already generated chunks, just like monsters do. When animals spawn in this way, they do only on grass blocks with a light level of 9 or greater above them. This is also a requirement for animals spawning from monster spawners. Unlike monster animals, do not spontaneously despawn, except for wild ocelots and wolves, which can despawn only when they are hostile. So basically what I'm getting from this is it's rare that they'll spawn there, but they can. It's light enough, and it is grass. You might need more grass. From that, I just got... We need more escalation. Uh, that was my other guess. Oh my god! Ah! That was a smart idea! Don't forget to replant it. I know. I you, know, you, you, you know you can just crouch and you could stand on it, right? Oh, I didn't know that worked like that. Yeah. I always thought that you would just destroy it if you're standing on it at all. No. You have to, you have to crouch, and then if you crouch enough, then. Well, yeah. not aiming for that block, but I definitely destroyed it. Oh, so, I'm gonna have you look at the uh, spawner after I finish the trap, so. Um, how am I gonna do this? 
I think I'm just gonna do it like a classical spawner. Yeah, I've never done a spawn trap, so I don't even know. Well, it's pretty easy. Something got destroyed. 